Beth and her mom are making five glasses of Kool-Aid. Each serving needs two-fifth cups of water. How many cups of water will they need? The first strategy we will use is a concrete model. We start by placing five circles to represent the five Kool-Aid cups. Then we partition each circle into five equal parts. We partition this into five equal parts because we are looking for fifths. The denominator is five. Next, we will shade two parts from each cup because each glass needs two fifth cups of water. If you count the shaded areas, you ten will get fifths. Another way to show ten fifths is we will draw the five cups again and shade in the ten parts, which completely fills two cups. For the next strategy, we will draw a picture. First, we start by drawing five cups to represent the five cups of Kool-Aid. Next, we will break the cups into five equal parts because we will need to shade in two-fifths of the cup for water. Then, we shade in two parts of each cup to represent the two-fifths water needed per cup. Once we shade in two-fifths of each cup, we will put all of the shaded parts together, getting ten-fifths or two. To solve this problem using an abstract model, we start by writing five times two-fifths. The five represents the glasses that Beth wants to make, and the two-fifth represents the water they need. We are looking for five groups of two-fifths. Here are the groups of two-fifths. So if you add two-fifths together five times, that equals ten-fifths, or two cups. To make five glasses of Kool-Aid, Beth and her mom need two cups of water. For more student math strategy videos, check out our U of H math education channel. Thank, Thank you for watching! watching.